Modflow Server is an exciting new tool that allows Modflow simulations to be edited, run, and visualized over the internet. With Modflow Server, anyone can run Modflow models, edit simulation inputs, and view results without installing Modflow or GIS software. The only required tool is a web browser. Modflow Server supports a wide array of model-based workflows to streamline and simplify complex tasks involved in running multiple simulations and summarizing results. It can be configured and customized to work for other models and projects. In this demo, I'll show an example of a Modflow Server application by using an application developed for the Utah Department of Water Resources, or DWR, for well permitting. This web application utilizes the Modflow Analyst Toolkit configured on an ArcGIS server to automate the process of editing and running a Modflow model used by the DWR to evaluate well permits. I can interact with the model in this window and visualize data such as hydraulic conductivity for each model layer. I can also view data associated with stress packages, such as the well package. By clicking on different model elements, I can see the input values in more detail. In this case, I'm viewing the location and pumping rate for one of the wells defined in the ModFlow model. The well permitting application allows different scenarios to be saved to analyze how the addition of a single well or a group of wells will affect the drawdown and flows in the aquifer. By selecting application ID 1001, I can see that for this scenario, two new wells are added to the model, well number one and well number two. The interface for adding wells to a scenario is found under the Well Applications tab. Here, well parameters such as well location, discharge rate, and screen elevations can be edited. Before running the simulation with the additional two wells, I'll adjust the drawdown contour interval. Clicking the Run Permitting tool will run ModFlow with the additional wells. The workflow progress can be monitored here in the Messages window. Execution of this specific workflow will take about 3 minutes. Now that the run has finished, I can view the results in the map interface. This application focuses on two criteria used by DWR to evaluate well permits. The first is drawdown, which is displayed as contours on the map. The second is changes to spring flow, and the springs are represented as drains in the ModFlow model. In viewing the model results, I can view specific values by clicking on certain features in the map. For example, I can click on one of the contour lines for drawdown. I can zoom in and select a drain to see the changes in flow for a specific cell. I can also view the total change in flow for an entire polygon. In this demo, 
I've highlighted some of the capabilities of the ModFlow server using the application designed for the Utah Department of Water Resources. Similar applications can be created and customized for other projects. Please visit our website to learn more.